welcome back to my channel guys i'm so excited to have you all here so today we are going to be drafting a basic sleeve and this is going to be the simplest sleeve you can ever try out just come with me and do not forget to hit the subscribe button let's go so guys the first thing we are going to be doing since we already have our measurement for our armhole is to mark, to mark all the basic points so i'm just going to be marking all the basic point the full length is 24 the full length of the sleeve that's um, from the shoulder to the wrist is So this is the full length. So the next thing we are going to be marking, we are going to mark five inches from the tip, five inches. This is going to be the major line for the armhole. So this line will be the bicep line. So I'll just be labeling it B or BI. We have our bicep already marked out. So just um, to get our to get our bicep, I use a standard measurement of five inch, which is actually uh, measured from the tip to this to where five inches is located and I'll liberate my bicep I already have the full length here the next thing we're just going to go into is to mark out three inches sometimes I mark out three and a half but between three inches and three and a half you just mark out three and a half like this so all you just need to do is mark out three and a half you don't need to extend it just um, put a point there and just join all you need to do is join. This is a very basic, easy sleeve to make. So when you're joining, this should be your um, mark line to determine where you should actually begin your curve. So when you have the, when you get here, you just extend this way. This is actually very, very basic and easy. Just extend to the five inch line. So what you have, you have this type of curve. The curve looks like um, a two like the number two, like um, someone will always say, draw the number two and you have the sleeve. So the next thing we have to do right now is to measure the wrist. So since we have just um, drafting the basic body patterns for a long sleeve, all you just need to mark right now is the wrist, the wrist um, width. The wrist of this person is eight inches. So we're going to be dividing eight inches by two. So eight inches divided by two is going to give us four inches. So I'll just mark out my four inches here always add seam allowance so i'm going to be adding one inch seam allowance here so this is my four inches um, which is the wrist divided by two eight divided by two plus one inch seam allowance and right now we already have we only cut this out we didn't measure it so we just go ahead and measure it back so what we got um from the arm hole was nine and a half so i'm just going to place my tape rule here and i'm just going to go ahead and measure so this is where my nine and a half stops. So I'll just be marking nine and a half here. So I'll just recurve. This is my nine and a half line. So all I just need to do, all that is left is to join. To join it down to the wrist. So this is your um, sleeve already drawn out, so I'll just be laboring this place W for the wrist, this is the bicep and this is the sleeve. So I'll just go ahead and cut out. It's as easy as that guys. So very easy guys, very very easy. I'm just going to be cutting out.
guys. So guys, you have your sleeve already cut out. One minute and you're done. If you're used to this, just one minute and you are done cutting your sleeve. Very easy, guys. See, this is opened. So this is the midpoint. You can actually just notch it. You can just notch it like this to just show the midpoint. And guys, that is all. Very easy. You don't need to start drafting anything. So I'll see you guys on my next video and I hope you enjoy this and you learned something today. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up and also drop your comments and do not forget to subscribe so that you can get notifications.